Okay. So, I saw that people on YouTube had their own air conditioner, old scrap unit that like didn't work anymore and stuff. So I got that idea. And I finally convinced my parents that I could have one. And we, we went to this air conditioner junkyard for just old air conditioners, just scrap parts, like old evaporator coils, old fan blades, old motors, old compressors, old everything, and they had whole units. So I got one. It's a ream. Ream, high efficiency. Wait till you see the date. Yeah, it's two bladed. You can see one blade there, and the other there, and there's no more. You can see down in there nicely. And it has an Emerson fan motor. Yeah. Here we go. August of 1983. Yep, eighth month, August of 1983. And it's a two ton. Right there, two ton. 32nd week of August 1983. Isn't that old? R22 refrigerant. 1983 And here's this little service area where you have all your parts and stuff like here's the here's the contactor and the capacitor and Here's the compressor and this thing is kind of loose. Oops. Oh geez. I just knocked that off of there completely Um So, uh, yeah, and here is, um, the suction line and the line that goes out, out of the furnace, and I don't know what this is, can you tell me about what this is, and then you can see in there the coils and stuff, and here's the bottom of the capacitor, which is like up here, here's the capacitor, here's the compressor. I don't know what went wrong in this unit actually. It just got replaced and it was sitting in an old air conditioner junkyard. So, got permission to take it. So, so it has a dent right here and also another one right here and one on the top. It's one of these old compressors where it has this thing right here and I don't know what brand that is. Maybe an old Bristol or Tecumseh or something. But there is there is a sticker right here, but I cannot read it because it is too faded. There's a sticker that says "Listed Central Air Conditioner Patent Something." It's now I must um, I'll make a separate video of cleaning up and restoring this unit to make it look like new again. I want, I want to do that, but you tell me if you think I should, because I can do it either way. And there, there's some leaves and a stick in there. Yeah, old ream. Good unit. I can kind of make out where you used to say ream right here. But I'm going to, yeah, I can see it's two bladed. I wonder if you can see the blades right there. I'm gonna go up here. There it is. Still can't see the uh, two blades for some reason. There, maybe it can see it right there. Yeah, two blades. And it did not come with that panel that covers up the wires and the compressor and stuff didn't come with that and it's free of freon doesn't have any refrigerant in it 
So I'm gonna put the phone like um right here. Spin the blades. I'll show you the amazing spin down time it has. Good Emerson fan motor. Look how amazing that spin down time is. Oh man, I just lost that stick in there. Now there's two sticks. Well, I can easily take this cover off because there's only a screw here and a screw here. These two screws are missing. It came like that. Yeah. I'll get these out sometime. Yep, there's the two sticks in there. I keep losing stuff inside there for some reason. But yeah, you saw how good that spin down time was. This is pretty unsafe right here, because you can stick your hand in there, but luckily it, your hand doesn't reach till the blades. But I'm gonna keep this these dents right here just to remain the old look, but I am going to get this dirt off of here and and just spray everything off with the hose and stuff like that. Yeah. I'll clean it up and restore it in the next video. I also got some logos that I'm going to show you. Out. So excited that I got this, by the way.